Happy Monday, boys and girls. It's spring. Happy spring. It is Monday, March 23rd, 2020. Um, I just wanted to say good morning to Jeremy. How are you? I hope you're doing your writing in your journal. I know you're playing some video games because I know how much you love those. Archer, I hope you're building some really cool things out of Legos. You and Quinn are hanging out together. And Kira, I hope you are reading every single day, and I know that you just look neat as a pen and beautiful as always. I miss you guys so, so much. I just can't even tell you. So here's a big virtual hug, and I miss you. But today, I'm going to do a quick math lesson with you. We're going to review how to decompose numbers and the strategies we've always used to add numbers. So let's take a quick look, okay? So let's look. We have 54 and 31. If I decompose these two numbers, I can do 50 and 4 and 30 and 1. Then it's going to be a lot easier to add. I can add 5 and 3 and get 8. If I just leave the 0 off, I know I'm going to put another number in that 1's place. And 4, one more, is 5. So I get 85. Okay? Let's try that again. If I take 63... The 6 is in the tens place, so that's 60. The 3 is in the ones place, so that's 3. Then I can decompose this number, and I've got 20 in the tens place and 3 in the ones place. Well, look, I've got 6 and 2 more I can count on. 6, 7, 8. 8 goes in the tens place. And, oh, 3 and 3. That's a double fact, and I know that that is 6, so my answer is 86. Okay, now let's look here at 71 and 13. I can decompose this into 70 and 1, 10 and 3. And if you need more of a visual, you can always write it out. 70 plus 10 would give me 80. And 1 plus 3, well, that's just one more. 3 and 1 more is 4. And that would give me 84. Okay? On Google Classroom and in the email that's going home to your parents, there'll be a few examples that you can give this a try. If you were able to pick up a packet before the schools close down, you can look for the two-digit pages and use those, or you can go back to um, any of the other games that you've played. Also, tomorrow the schools will be open again for um, packet pickup. We have, um, we had 10 days worth in your packet already, so there's no new materials to pick up. So if you've already got your packet, you're good for this week. If you weren't able to get your packet last week, you can get it tomorrow. There should be an email from the schools about that for you. So have a great Monday. I miss you so much. Um, in reading, you're going to um, go to Storyline Online and have a book read to you. There's a few questions about it in Google Classroom. And for science, I have linked a really cool mini lesson about reptiles for you. So I hope you enjoy it. Have a good day. Love you bunches. Miss you bunches. Bye munchkins.